Hi, people. Um, I'm here in uh, Ikea, in the city that's near. Yeah, I'm here in Ikea, and I'm going to look for a dresser for the clothes so that my clothes are not like wing wang everywhere in my room. So it's nice to be organized. Just a small one. I know I can look at it online, but I prefer to physically see it. It, it does something with my you know like so you know measurements and all that stuff I, I just prefer to see it touch it and all that stuff in you know so today since it's uh the day of the Lord, Sunday, all that stuff. Ikea has a lot, a lot of like shoppers. Well, there's a long line, basically. Uh, I'll still go in. Oh, they have a big bag of the, the gay flag bag. I'm gonna get one also. So the line is moving pretty fast, so that's good. It's still a big line. I guess this is a good thing because everyone's calling it. Line there too. It goes in the corner, but it's a fast line, so. So, I didn't have my, they didn't have the cabinet that I, the drawer, the clothes drawer that I, was a research and all that, but it's out of stock because everybody had bought it. So they said next week they'll have it. Mm. Everybody bought it because it's the cheapest and the smallest, and that's what I want. I have a small room, so the drawer is about just like this big, yay big, and yay like that tall, and then like this like the depth is like that and like you know like it's like that way it's wide so that would be perfect for the room that I'm in and it's all black and just a symbol I can build a drawer maybe better but it's not gonna cost like IKEA so I'd rather like get the IKEA one because it's easy so hey, I I also got um, some things like for the door where I can hang like things. This is like one ninety nine. Like in Walmart, it's like fourteen dollars. We're not the same thing, but this is like a better design. So that's a good deal. And. Got two ninety nine pack of things that I can put like uh, you know electronic items and gadgets. I can put that just to organize more things. So not everything is scattered. I was looking at that. I was looking at um, the IKEA and no, like there. And that's the highway right there. I was looking at that and realized something why they they're not looting this place. Hey man, you don't loot IKEA man. It's it's it's, it's cool. IKEA is cool, cool with the people, you know. And also, practicality. Practicality in the matter of, like, this location is a fortress. It's on top of a hill. And to get into the neighborhood, there's, it's in the other hill. And the highway is far away. You have to climb the hill to get up here. And what's to look like here? <laughs> you go up here too. 
like ransack cabinets and chairs and then bedsets and photons. <laughs> it's like, <laughs> hey yo, could you help me out with this cabinet? <laughs> it's not like shoes or electronics. You know what I mean? Like, you could probably like loot this. <laughs> what are you gonna do with this? Or loot this. <laughs> what are you gonna do with this? Say yo, you can hang it on the window. <laughs> they'll, they'll hang you with it. <laughs> or, or you can like loot this 99 cents <laughs> battery charger. Pulling like the poor double battery. Yeah, you can loot that. <laughs> what else can you loot? <laughs> so much to loot here. This is a furniture store. If you gotta loot something, you be like looting like clothes, like like I saw on the internet. It's bad that they they looted it. Like your know, Nike stores, you know, outlets, you know, like something that like you can like wear and dispose of quick, and something you can carry. I don't encourage looters, but. I think looting is bad. The expression that they're they're doing, that's something else, you know, you wanna express anger, put it in a like more creative, productive and positive uh, energy or a activity rather than harming a business, burning down cities, burning down neighborhoods and businesses, breaking windows. That's all negative. That's like what 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 does that do? So that's my take on it. I, I don't condone the, the, the feeling to protest, you know. But I don't support the looting and the destruction of other people's property. Because like even though they they have like a corporate logo that they're using, man, those investments of people who own those business, you know, purchase those franchises. That's their livelihood. And, you know they're helping the neighborhood improve the neighborhood like let's say like a neighborhood that doesn't have like a like a drugstore nearby and the neighborhood needs it like someone will invest on putting buying a franchise and putting in the Walgreens or CVS and then they're gonna loot it and I was like well, who does that go? <laughs> who does that help that's my more and more in um, in social media, in YouTube, I see uh, neighborhoods, the people in the neighborhood protecting their neighborhoods. You know, they're not allowing anything like, okay, there's a big bunch of people coming in, they don't know who they are, agitators and professional organizers to, to protest and loot. Those neighborhoods are not allowing it. You know, they're using every means protest against the protesters you know if you want to protect your neighborhood you want peace and you don't want your neighborhood to be vandalized you know it's one thing to express your uh, freedom you know your first amendment freedom of speech that's one thing looting that's that's as good as assault you're assaulting someone's livelihood property and you know, basically life, you're ruining their life. Let's say it takes them like five, ten years to recover, to, to recover from that, that loss in their business. Guess what, that's like time, like five, ten years lost in their life, doing something else that they could have been doing already. So, stop. yeah, I support, I support the movement. Wear a black shirt. I support that. Well, that's my thing. I got a bag of their sausage, their cider. They gave me a bag of chips. I don't know, maybe they got confused. I didn't buy the bag of chips. But she gave it to me. And then also their one dollar, one dollar uh, frozen yogurt. Okay, in the bag. So I'm done with IKEA. And um, 
might go home or go somewhere else to check out like another like item that would like it'll be cool to have and makes easy, uh, the thing that I'm doing easy I want it that, that's all <laughs> shop for it because it's Sunday it's the day of the Lord so yeah bye bye Ikea that's Ikea right here Let's see